What do we have here? It doesn't look very exploratory. We have Kiowe? Kiowe? Kiowe. I'm gonna go Kiowe. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. I don't know. But he's Kiowe to me. I'm Kiowe. My Marowak and I are students of the ancient dances that have been passed down in Alola for generations. The trial of Kiowe, you will find that is a bit different than the trials you have faced to this point. But of course, you will attempt it, right? I mean, damn straight, I'm gonna attempt it. Fuck. Who do you think I am? Yeah. My trial will test your powers of observation. There will be a dance. Then another. Your task will be to find the difference between the two. Begin. <laughs> okay, alright, alright. Uh. Watch carefully and memorize the stance. Okay, alright. Alright, the twirl is around. What the hell do you want me to do with that? What was different from the previous dance? Uh The left Marowak. The middle Marowak. The right Marowak. That's boring. Show me again. I'm not telling them to fucking show me again. Um I mean I, I mean the middle one, he ended in the middle, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna say that. I'm probably stupid as fuck, but that's okay. The middle one. B but how? That was truly spectacular. Add that to the spectacle. Of course, of course, I was right. Damn straight. Ah, right. Of course, I was right. He did a little bit different. <laughs> All right, we got Dupater here. This thing is going to be level 18. Okay, good. That is a little bit of a relief. I, I don't know if it's ground. I don't know if it's fire. It kind of has the flame thing going on. Maybe it's both. If it is both, that would be great. Actually, look at that flame wheel. Maybe it's ground fire. Maybe it's just fire. I don't know. But look at that. Very nice. Bubble beam here. Maybe we could get four times super effective. I don't know. I forget it's typing. Well, either way, it was powerful as fuck. And you know what? Just so I know, just so I know, I'm going to look up what the hell that typing is on a Lolan Marowak. What on earth is that? Uh, Fire Ghost. Wow. <laughs> All right. Word. That's cool. Marek was so pleased by your right answer that it simply had to battle you. Well, damn straight, I'm sure it fucking did. Onward to the second dance. What do you want me to do with my life, ma'am? Watch carefully and memorize this dance. What the hell is the hiker doing here? Hiker just fucking photobomb this shit. Like, they're about to get ready to, like, do their, you know, sacred ritual. I don't know what the hell it is. Fucking kumbaya. And then this guy's just like, yo, what's good, fam? I don't want to see you here. I got to pass the trial. Who is this jackass coming in here? Fucking jack off. Get out of here. He's still there. Uh. Fuck. I'm gonna, I'm, 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 the hiker, the hiker, hey, hey, that's an option, jack off, yeah, this guy, yeah, damn straight, that's what I'm saying, get the hell out of here, do we have to bail the hiker, bruh, bruh, sending out a freaking magmar, that's crashing the party. <laughs> we don't welcome this. What are you doing here? No. You just come in. They're doing their fucking dance. They're doing, you know, I don't know what the hell they're doing. They're doing some crazy tribal shit. And you just come in, you know, like thinking that you're tough shit. Why are you here? That's like, no, you're not welcome here. You know, it's all right. You're just gonna get fucking wrecked. It's okay. It's all right. Free XP for me. Damn. God damn it though. Why? It's so like, it's okay. You know what, man? Hey. He showed some enthusiasm. We get power up punch! Yo, power up punch! Yo, 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 power up punch. That is my move right there, man. Yo, we just got Rock Tomb. We're gonna get rid of. Actually, I'm gonna get rid of Leer. Because, I mean, lowering their defense, I mean, it's pretty much the same thing as raising our attack, right? You know, I mean, it has a different philosophy to it. But, I mean, same, same shit, pretty much, right? Yeah, fuck it. I'm going for it. 
All right, so we got a douchebag. He honestly looks like a douchebag. That's what I was saying before. He looks like an honest just douchebag. When you think of a stereotypical douchebag, his face, his everything about him just looks douchebag. And that's all there is to it. That's what I'm saying. I don't know. My hacker friend was so pleased by your right answer. Yeah, yeah, no shit. All right, I got it. I got the message. I got it right. I'm fucked. Great. Onward to the final dance. Is this the totem Pokemon now? No, okay, I don't think so. Douchebag. <sighs> Does not know how to get home. Douchebag is having a good time. Dude, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> I, uh, the suspicious Pokemon? Dude! Oh, that's the totem. Oh. I didn't mean to insult you, man. I'm sorry. Don't fuck up my team. Oh, uh, Salazzle. Oh, shit. That's the evolution. Oh, Salandit does evolve. I... Uh, whoops. I didn't mean to offend thee. <laughs> well, you know, I'm just going to die here with Duke Fighter because its special defense is up and it's like poop. And you're going to use Toxic. No. Oh, that's mean. That's mean. Ooh. Yo, I'm sorry. I feel bad. I, I think I pissed this guy off. I didn't mean to, like, piss you off or anything by... Ooh, speed fell. That's cool. Like, I knew I was pissed when this guy just came in the middle of their dance ritual, but, like, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Like, fuck. All right, we got sound it. Man, now I kind of want to use that. I didn't know that it evolves... Like, damn, sorry. Oh, my goodness. My goodness, man. Uh, peace out, y'all. Well, damn. Okay. Power up punch is about to come through. An insane amount right now. We're gonna go power punch, then we're gonna go brick break, and it's gonna be fucking amazing. I promise it to you all. No, we're gonna go power up punch, then we're gonna go maybe Z move if necessary. We'll see how it goes. Of course, you're gonna go toxic. I really don't like that. I really don't like that because that's gonna just chip away, chip away, and do more and more and more. And I don't like that. I don't like that coming from a freaking totem Pokemon. And we're gonna get a Venoshock right to the fucking face. All right. No, that's a crit. That's not good at all. Oh, lordy. Okay. Okay. Fuck. Um. Damn. Hmm. I'm gonna try and go Trumbeak, you know what? Because that, that pluck, that's a physical move. And that, that special defense little boost thing that, that that won't be a part of this all right so we're gonna go work up against this salazzle mm, asshole character perfect that means that w wait what we had a berry do we have pickup is that an ability do we have pickup or did i give it a berry and i didn't know it what just happened what just happened what just happened I don't even- I didn't even read what it said, guys. I didn't read what it said. I don't know if that just- I think I said- I think it said it raised my, like, special attack, but I, I don't even know why that matters. Do we have pickup? I don't think we have pickup. What the hell is going on? I am confused, guys. I am honestly confused as all hell. And there we go. See, I'm buying another pen now. My pens suffer really badly from this shit. 23. That's great. That's honestly gonna be helpful. To finish this off here, <clears throat> Venoshock, don't stop. No, I don't want to die from this. I really don't. Great. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go with the puck, man. Maybe we could, maybe we could one shot it or something. I don't know. I don't know. But hey, something two levels higher and a lot stronger than it did a lot of damage. So okay, close enough. Close enough for me. Switch into the Tora Cat. We'll be all good, man. We'll be all good. We'll, we'll, we'll survive it. Barely, holy fuck, barely. 
I mean that. When I say barely, <laughs> this, is, this is as close as it gets right here. Okay, well, maybe not as close as it gets. Um, I, I've seen worse, but um, this is rather... This is rather close. I will say that. We do outspeed, thank God, and we're good. Great. This guy crashed the party. He's about to fucking destroy the party. But no, man. We took... We took down the totem Pokemon again, barely, by the skin of our teeth. Holy fuck, man. Shit. Shit's crazy. And yo, the Marowax are hype as fuck now. They could go through their, their routine without douchebag hyper, hikers, hypers, hikers, and douchebag totem Pokemon getting in their way. So that, that's refreshing. Whoa, spectacular. Great. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. With your keen observations, you were able to see even fine differences in our dance moves. Yeah. Yeah. You're damn right. You even defeated the Totem Pokemon with such ease. Yeah, I wouldn't say such ease, but hey, I appreciate the gesture. This Totem Pokemon was carrying a Ethereum Z, so a fire type move, which is going to be really cool, of course, for our Tauracat. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm just saying, I do dig that dance move that those Marowaks are rocking. I really do. So we got that Ethereum Z and trial. Complete. Boom. Just like that. We are, we are four trials down, and... I think there's like, aren't there like seven in the whole game or something? Like, I don't know. I forget the exact number, but we're making progress. I know that much. This is how you use the fire type Z power. I mean, there's like the other ones, right? Oh, yeah, that. The dance move. I'm sorry. That was bad. So something like boom, boom, boom. Psh, psh, psh. Something like that. I mean, it's my best interpretation of it. Thank you, my dear Marowak. That almost makes me want to use one, but it's another fire type. I don't, I don't love the double typing thing. I mean, it's not a huge issue right now, but I I keep it in mind a little bit. Well, damn, Daniel. Ten quick balls. Yo, you whip, man. Ooh, that is great. And Charizard. Ooh, we get fly, man. Yo, this is great. This is great. No HMs to worry about. No HMs to worry about, guys. That is a beautiful, beautiful thing. Honestly. I hope we do get Surf at some point, because Surf is a good move to have if we do get a Water type, which we do. I'm just kidding. We have we have Dewpiter, my bad. But damn, look at that. Look at that. Oof. We're doing good, man. We're doing good for ourselves. You know, I'm proud of our team. We're, we're pulling through, you know. What's down here? We, uh... Yeah, that's right there. Okay. Very, very cool. So we do have up ahead, we... We have that barricade. That's how we're going to get out of here. I just realized there's a fast rigging through this patch of grass, but that's okay. And we have that sound. Man, that makes me tempted as all hell to use it. I'm going to resist a little bit. I'm going to resist the urge. Just a little bit. And yeah. Uh, fuck. Yeah, we have that barricade from earlier that we discovered. A Fletchling! Yo, I was not expecting that here! I would not have expected that, like, at all. A little Fletchling. Cool. Hey. That ain't bad. Alright, so yeah. Barricade will, uh... Why are these appearing so frequently? We'll, we'll run through the barricade and we'll be all good. Another little Fletchling, man. You know, honestly, when I hear Fletchling, I just always think of the beginning of X and Y. I think that beginning animation where you have the little Fletchling trying to wake you up. Just a beautiful cutscene that really ushered in, you know, Gen 6. Just just a beautiful thing. Honestly. Honestly. So yeah, we're gonna We're gonna we're gonna head over here now. Got that barricade though. Are, are they gonna like heal us soon? Cause like we only have Toracat and I kinda don't wanna just have Toracat. I wanna have some more Options. That's just me. Hell yeah, man! Look at that! We 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 did the Macarena, we did the YMCA, we did Cotton Eye Joe, we did so much dancing and everything up there. It was great, man. It was great. We're free to pass. That is great. Go along Route 8 and you'll find it. Uh, oh, Captain Mallow. Oh, damn. Lush jungle. So, jungle. Jungle. Grass types. Team. We need grass. That's cool. Can we get a Pokemon Center, please? You there! Don't battle me. Who on earth are you? Oh, that's the... Oh, wait, is that? That's Colress! From, like, Gen 5. Colress. I don't know the Gen 5 story that well, so... I don't know what to say about that, but... Cool!
<laughs> oh, excuse me, I'm a scientist. My name is Coress. My theme of my the theme of my research is bringing out the potential of Pokemon. What brings out the power of Pokemon is I believe that is the bond they share with their trainers, and thus my attention is drawn to trainers like yourself. Trainers bound to their Pokemon through the power of the Z-Ring. Can you show me like Mega Evolution? Because like that's the bond as well, you know? Yeah. Now that I think of it, I never asked your name. Yeah, of course, it's Joss. Josh, Joss, what the hell am I doing? To commemorate our encounter, let me give you a TM. Flame charge! Ooh. I mean, Tora Cat? Alright. If you utilize, uh, to be able to, if, blah, blah. If you're able to utilize flame charge fully, you'll be able to have a great battle with the totem in, your, uh, in the next trial. The trial in Lush Jungle. Man, I cannot speak for the life of me right now. Z power. Is it true? The potential that I seek mm, does it surpass the Mega Ring? Apparently, there. <coughs> I'm losing my voice. <coughs> Sorry about that. Apparently, there are uninhabited islands for Pokemon called Poke Palago here in Alola. I remember that. Alola is fa fascinating. I believe that I will stay in Alola for some time. Well, then, Josh, I hope to see you again sometime. Interesting. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> so actually, wow, we get flame charge with wow a few Pokemon. Um, for now I'm actually good. You know, fire fire fang is a very powerful move, and I don't think we really need that with Trumbeak necessarily. Not yet, I would say. So <clears throat> wow, what the hell am I doing? Is there really like no Pokemon centers here, man? <sighs> All right, I think we gotta. We got. Oh yeah, we can. We can fly, man. What am I doing? Why did I not fly before? All uh, right. Can we just like fly here? No. Fly to a Pokemon Center, I guess. Right. Wow, I just realized looking at that map, we have a lot of this island explored already. Damn. Well, hey, thank you, thank you, Charizard. Very useful there. All right, so Route 5, that brings us to... Hopefully, we could fly back to somewhere closer. We don't have to walk all the way back. But hey, at least half of the walking journey, whatever, is done. So that is very good. And yeah, with that being said, we're gonna... Probably gonna be looking for our fifth team member with this upcoming jungle. I mean, I definitely want a Grass-type. Or an Electric-type. But I think Grass-types are gonna be easier to find, so... So, yeah. Oh, man, excuse me. Alright, so, yeah, we have a good chunk of the island done. Cool. Uh, where do we want to go? Alright, so we're gonna... I guess we'll fly there. And, yeah, I believe there are also, by the way... I'm not definite on this, but there are some locations in the first island. I don't know if we were supposed to go there on our own, but that we didn't visit yet. And it looks like a lot of water, and now we could ride on the water. So, I'm not sure about it, but, you know, hey, we'll see. See what goes. And, yeah, I think we're going to ride on Tauros a little bit. Get some speed going, you know what I'm saying? Make that progress. All right, let's go. I'm pressing down that B button. Hold on, JK, we're going down here. We're going down here. Maybe we're not. Pokemon refresh. Can we uh, surf here? Uh, does not look like an explorable area, so I'm okay with that. <laughs> and, yeah, I don't think we could climb those ledges, by the way. I'm just going to make that little assumption. And is this an area that we can... It is! Cool. Glad that I got off. And what is this? Is this the Aether Foundation? Hi, little trainer. Looks like you've got Pokedex on you. How would you like to do a little part-time work on behalf of the Aether Foundation? Sure! We at the Aether Foundation work to protect Pokemon through conservation. In order to protect Pokemon, though, we must know a good deal about them and how they live. Right now, we are surveying the Stuffle that live on Route 8. What the hell is a Stuffle? The Foundation is collecting its own data, of course, but we would like to all know also what data the Pokedex records about them. So your job, if you should choose to accept it, would be to register Stuffle on Route 8 in your Pokedex and then show us the data. We will pay you for the work, of course. I hope you'll help us out. Cool. We are members of the Aether Foundation. We work to carry out conservation efforts by and care Pokemon. All right, Giachu. Interesting. So I have heard of the Aether Foundation from the trailers and whatnot. And yeah, they're kind of like a good team, like you know, not an evil team. They're there to you know like help people out and stuff. And we have 
another little thing for the Zygarde cube. I wonder, you know, I have never looked at this. Is there actually anything there that we could, like, look at? Use? No, I guess not. <laughs> guess not. Uh, yeah. I guess we can't really. So, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna look for the Stuffle, and I'll tell you why. This is, if it's a grass type, I want to use it, possibly. Yeah, that's all there is to it. So we have a Trombeak here. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, shit. I don't ever be able to run away from this thing. Uh, maybe. Wow. Pluck. No, don't do that. That's gonna kill us. Next turn. Great. Okay. Kind of just healed up, but you know, hey. That's okay, right? Uh, alright. <clears throat> Let us switch. Do we want to do that? Eh, yeah, I guess that works. So yeah, find stuff will maybe. And before we do that, hey, we got some stuff over here, right? Maybe? Just this? Uh, big Pearl, I mean, hey, money, right? Money's cool. We got a couple uh, Big Pearls from that other area, so why not, right? Um, can we surf here, by the way? We can fish. Can't surf. We can fish. We're gonna land something, alright? I mean, probably not gonna catch it, but that's alright. That's a little Magikarp. How could you, how could you fish without getting a Magikarp, man? It's just, it's iconic. It's symbolic of what, you know, the old rod symbolizes at least. I mean, this is kind of just a general fishing rod now, but that's okay. That's alright. And yeah, let's just, I I'm curious what the hell a Stuffle is. So I'm actually gonna go back on that Tauros now. And yeah, I don't think I'm gonna go out of my way because I don't know how big this route is. Just in case we happen to have to go in the grass at some point, like uh, over here possibly, you know. And you, hello, hello. Good deal, good deal. So yeah, we're gonna want Torcat to be powerful for this trial because hopefully we can just sweep through the trial nice and easy with you know a uh, fire type. Because I would assume it's gonna be a lot of grass bugs that kind of thing. So we got Bone Sweet. Uh, I forget what that thing evolves into. May not. Slash if it evolves. I don't know. So yeah, we're gonna go with the Fire Fang. I'm debating right now if I want Lick or Flame Charge. Flame Charge is nice. We get that speed boost, which is never a bad thing. But I don't know. I mean, Lick. Lick is useful for a few reasons. It's good if you want to move that doesn't do a whole lot of damage, in a sense, because. Yeah, we can definitely get rid of something here. We got Bug Bite, Infestation, what does this do? Uh, four to five turns. Uh, da, 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 da. More much? Definitely a little bit more special attackers. I mean, I'm going to go for a Spider Web. It's kind of useless since we have Infestation, really. But what was I saying? Yeah, because uh, it's also nice because, you know, that is a good chance of paralyzing. And sometimes it's nice, you know, you want to do some paralysis. So, I don't know, man. I don't know, I'm a little bit conflicted about that. Mm. Yeah, we can go for a fire thing here. Fire thing is a nice move to have, honestly. Just does, does a good amount of damage. Sometimes you just need that. Just against anything, really, that's normally effective. Man, I'm a hell of a pen biter tonight. I don't know why. I have three pens on my desk, and they are just taking a beating right now. Uh, we're gonna go. We're gonna go with the bite here. Hopefully, we can push through this confusion. I'm not really feeling that. There we go. Look at us pulling through, pulling through. That's very nice. Very nice, right there. Confusion's annoying, guys. Confusion is so annoying. All right. There we go. Very nice. And was there an item down there yet? Wasn't item down there? That's a little annoying. Uh, so hyper potion. Hey, I will take a hyper potion, man. Gladly. All right, so we'll battle you in a minute, I guess. Uh, what the hell's that? I am chilling down there. Yeah. So that's what I'm saying. If we're gonna have to go through grass. I don't want to go out of my way before I have to go through it anyway. Yeah, scientist, motherfucker. <clears throat> the hell. I don't know why my voice is going on me too, man. Tyrone. Tyrone does not sound like the name of a... Not sound like the name of a scientist, I'm not gonna lie. Tyrone. It just doesn't. <clears throat> ah, 
Dude, Peter, why, man? Why? I might just go with the Z move. Just kind of brute force. If I'm being honest here. Might be our best bet. I know it's part flying, and you could use Water Gun or. Not Water Gun. What am I saying? Water Gun. We don't have a Pokemon with Water Gun. What am I saying? But. Like, Wing Attack. But I mean, shit, man. Z move. Z move is powerful. Wait, what the hell? No, 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 wait a bit. I was curious, because two of them came up. I'm wondering if one of them will get the benefits of Power Up Punch still. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm a little curious. I'm a little curious. We'll see next time. I definitely want to know that, because if we could get Z-Power, like, and get, like, the attack boost, that would be insane. So, we're getting all amped up here. Got the owl out pummeling. Mm, boom. Look at that. You know, I feel a little bit bad for the other, the other side sometimes. It's kind of just like, you know, that, that, that sucks. That really sucks. But hey, you know, it's all good. It's all good. Uh... Torcat, look at that, level 26, getting up there. Now I'm biting my fucking styles. What am I doing, man? What am I doing? But yeah, we got a... Hold on, coming out, not too bad. God damn, it doesn't even appear anymore. I'm curious, man, I wanna know. I really am curious. Because if we could get a Z move and get the attack boost, like, that would be so insane, man. Like, I would use that every time. And of course you have sturdy, god damn it. Sometimes you can't escape it, guys. You cannot escape it every time. So, yeah, we're gonna... I mean, fuck. We're gonna power up punch, I guess, because it has more PP. Whatever. I probably should go for, like, a bubble beam. You're gonna metal sound me. What the hell's wrong with you, man? Metal sound. Alright. I think this next battle, just so I don't forget about it, I'm gonna lead off with Crab Brawler just for that sole purpose of seeing that goddamn Z move. Because I am very curious about that, really. Alrighty. It is time. Yeah, see what happened last time was I was using my fucking chubby thumbs. No, no, I haven't chubby. I was using my 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 thumb to try to get a very small part of the touch screen. That's just not the way to do it, man. That's not the way to do it. So I mean, hey, perfect example here, fucking mill tank. Fuck it, why not, right? Use that Z move. All right, I'm biting my pen again. What am I doing? Hmm. 100. Wow, so if we get, like, a really powerful fighting type move, that'll do an insane amount of damage. So, it looks like we do not get... Yeah, it looks like we do not get the attack boost, which, I mean, I guess is perfectly reasonable. We already get an insanely powerful move. So, that's okay. That's okay, honestly. Alright. So we got the Z-Move coming to us again. <laughs> I like the Z-Move, man. I like the Z-Move. The Z-Move that I've actually seen, I gotta say using some other ones, man. But all up pummeling, this shit is intense. I was originally not a huge fan of the Z-Moves. This shit's pretty badass, I can't lie. Like, look at this. Like, how do you not, like, love that? Like, that's... Come on, how do you tank that, man? How do you even do that? How's that possible? Bastard. Wow. I don't even know what to say to that. That's like insanely powerful. I mean, it doesn't matter, we're still gonna win, but like, what the hell, man? That's like, that's fucked up. Damn. And now we gotta crack. God damn it. God damn it. Okay, whatever, man. Nothing I could do, right? Nothing I could do. Fuck. Alright. Well, I'm gonna go back into Torcat, get that XP popping. Definitely important for this upcoming trial. And I think we're approaching the end of this route, so... I might start running in the grass. Find that stuffle, whatever the hell that thing was called. Uh, it depends on how long this goes down. Pokemon Center, that's very nice. 
Very, very nice. I will take that. So yeah, I guess uh, this is pretty much like the end of the route. Sort of. I don't know. We got a... It's like another area down there that we can kind of explore. But, you know, yeah, that's... As you guys have seen, that's my main goal with these routes is, uh, you know, explore them fully as, as far as I could see. And, you know, yeah, get the most out of them. That is for sure. This guy gonna battle? Alright, we'll check this out in a minute, because I'm curious. But, what are you doing? Wait, what? There's a dude near here who says that he wants to make a whole theme park full of nothing but fossils. That is cool! I like that. Fossil Pokemon are cool, man. Honestly. Fossil Restoration Center. Let's make a fossil-filled wonderland. Very nice. <laughs> I like that. Welcome to the Dream Park, where dreams become reality and fossils become Pokemon. Someday, this whole place is going to be filled to bursting. Filled to be filled to bursting. With Pokemon from the ancient past. That is my dream for this. The Dream Park, to bring the ancient world back to life. Well, that is just excellent. Excellent work, man. Well, that is okay. There's like nothing here. Got my hopes up, I guess. That's for sure. And what is this little... I saw this little patchy area down here. What the hell is this? Right here. Is that just all grass? No items? Oh. Miracle Seed. Ooh. That is cool. Very useful if we're going to get a grass type here. Miracle Seed. A lot of items today. All right. Kind of took a little bit of a longer path there so we can get a Pokemon here. Do we have a Stuffle? That is a Young Goose. That is useless. Uh, what a shame. Okay. Honestly, whatever the hell it is, probably just going to throw a Quick Ball at it because maybe they'll give us something cool. You know, the Aether Foundation. You never know. So, yeah. Let's just, uh, I'm going to keep on exploring a little bit. I got this other area right over here, whatever the hell this is. Is this a trainer here? We got a golfer? We got a golfer, guys! <laughs> I was not expecting to see a golfer class in this game, not gonna lie, even if it's a tropical area. I don't know. I don't know. Well, we got rock rough here, not too bad. And actually, is that is that actually part rock type? I have no idea, I think it's just normal type, but you know, I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to go for a fire thing. You know, yeah, I don't think I've... Have I ever beaten a rock rough? It seemed like a common enough Pokemon. Yeah, it is It is part rock, I would guess now. Wow. Cool. Or something else. I don't know. I don't know what it is, but something. All right. Not too bad. Not complaining. And we have a few uh, buildings here, a few houses. I mean, maybe we can find something useful. Some useful stuff. After we battle another golfer. What's up with the golfers here? Maybe we'll get some items. I mean, you know, these specialized areas, you know, malls and other areas, you know, they have a lot of items. Maybe some golfer resort area. I don't know, has something. Well, we have an Alolan Meowth. I forget here. Is fire not very effective against dark? I forget, to be honest. So, uh, okay, good. Yeah, we're good. We all good. We all good. Wow, one hit it. Torquette is starting to run away with it a little bit. Not a bad thing. I'm okay with that, man. I am okay with that. These these totem Pokemon, man, these trials in general have been just a challenge and a half. So I'm okay with getting OP at all. We're not even OP, to be honest. We're kind of barely dragging on by. But, ooh, we gotta, we gotta get off here to get into this little nook and cranny. A dive ball. Okay. Anything good here? No? Alright, fair enough. Maybe so we could actually go into... No, no... Yeah, alright, cool. Give me something good. Gladion, get out. Uh. <laughs> Maybe we talk to him enough. Maybe he'll fucking punch us or... Get the machete under his bed. <laughs> I know. Get out. Okay, I'm going to take that a little bit seriously. Maybe maybe not as serious as I actually did, but, you know, hey, that's all right. Anything good here? I'm afraid we got no vaccines today. Ooh. The boy staying there paid up two years worth of nights when he first got here. 
Though he's not so free with cash now as he used to be. Seems like Team Skull doesn't pay well enough to live off of. Wow, okay. That's intense. That's weird, hold on. Her dialogue doesn't look as crisp. Like, look at the text. I don't know if that's just me, but damn. Damn, damn, damn. Stay hydrated 